All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. The one in Curly. It's your girl, Shanika, here. And I'm back with another video. It feels so weird because I haven't been on my channel posting. I haven't recorded a video in so long. So, I'm finally here. And today, um, I'm just kind of going with the flow. Um, I'm going to be doing my makeup right now. I just thought I'd pull out my camera and record it a little bit. Maybe talk to you guys. I have no clue what I'm doing yet. So, let's just get right into it. So, I guess I'm just going to kind of do like my most recent makeup routine, I guess. And it's summer now. It's super hot outside. I don't like wearing a lot of makeup in the summertime um i try to keep my skin as best as possible so i don't have to wear any makeup um but when i do this is the routine that i kind of opt for it's very light and um yeah my main focus is kind of just to just get my skin healthy and very glowy you know uh, and very dewy and shimmery so in order to achieve that okay I start off with a base and what I use is this Melanie Mills Hollywood Gleam Body Radiance. It's basically just like a cream glitter and I just put it on my face. You can pretty much use it like a primer. It looks like this. I don't know if you guys can see that. Can you all see that? I guess you can see that. Yeah, it's basically just a gold. It's called the shade is in deep gold. They have so many different kinds. Uh, deep gold because it looks the best on my dark skin complexion. So I just put it all over my face. And you guys can see that it instantly turns me into a golden disco ball. Like I'm shining so much. And I put it down to my chest, rub that in. And yeah. I'm so sorry, I haven't been uploading very much, but hopefully I can get a few videos done today. And yeah, um, this summer has been um, pretty chillax, pretty relaxing. Hasn't been too eventful, but it is what it is. Okay, got that done. So now, like, you guys can instantly see how glowy my skin is right now. Um, I just love this. Like, I'll just go out like this. If you, I'll just go out like this. If you don't want to use this, um, NYX also has, like, a, a shimmery, like, highlighting um, cream that you can buy as well any any like shimmer highlight cream you can pretty much purchase at Sephora or at the drugstore whatever will work next I'll do my concealer and I think I'm going to use um my LA girl pro concealer I'm gonna use this concealer I don't want to look into the the camera because I feel like that's distracting. But I can't believe right now it's August. It's August it's August 12th or the 13th. Like summer has what day is it? No. A girl doesn't even know the days of the week. Look, I'm on my own time. But anyways, um, my point is that summer's coming to an end so fast. Like, it just came so quickly. And just went by so quick. Like, why? Why, why, why? Like, that's crazy to me how fast it flew by. And, um... Remember back in the day, like in high in in high school, so and like in elementary school, 
when you're younger you know summer was just like a few was a few months it was two months and like now I'm in university and the school break is four months and like even four months feels so short it just flies by fast like that's honestly what it is like anyways so I did my under eyes I usually just do that and my upper lip like right here I blend that in with my finger y'all this is a super quick easy routine like literally when I do this without recording it or anything like on a normal day if I were to do this it will take me like five minutes no joke five to ten minutes okay that's good enough and then um I'm going to be taking this is a translucent powder I'm not really going to be naming all the products if I don't if I miss a few products and I don't name properly I'm sorry but I'm kind of just doing my own thing right now and that's pretty much to absorb this powder is just going to kind of keep my concealer from creasing and also um kind of prevent me from getting oily throughout the day I'm using mascara now. This is the, I don't even know what it is. Some random mascara I just grabbed. I think it's Smashbox. So down below and let me know what your favorite part of your summer was but also just out of curiosity tell me what your favorite season is mine has always been summer because my birthday is in summer July 16th but let me know what let me know what your favorite month is or sorry let me know what your favorite season is I'm a hot mess right now. Oh, about my hair. So let me talk about my hair. So, hold on. You guys can see that the red is still there. It's still popping. I don't know if it's just the lighting in this room, but it's it's it faded a, a lot, I feel like. It did fade, but for the most part it's still it's still vibrant like I can still see the color and um, I'm kind of like in the middle of debating if I should go back and get another um, haircut because um, my ends kind of feel a little dry and uh, the ends feel um, Dam not they don't feel damaged but when I look at my hair like when I first got my hair cut like the ends were crisp okay they were so crisp they were so smooth and I just I just think because it's been like what how much months maybe like three months now obviously um obviously some People say you should be trimming your hair, giving your hair a trim every three months. Um, so maybe I'm just thinking maybe it's time for a trim because I'm trying to keep my hair as healthy as possible, especially given the fact that I dyed my hair. So I'm trying to prevent as much damage. And what I'm really curious to see is how my hair keeps up when I, um, when I straighten it. But it's also something that I'm like, mm, do I really want to straighten my hair? First of all, it's very time consuming. Second of all, it's so much damage. Like before I dyed my hair, like dyeing my hair just made me more protective of my hair, if that makes any sense. Uh, I know that might sound some crazy to some people, but like I've always been natural. Like it wasn't like 
yeah i've always been natural i never had to go through that old transitioning stage from like perm or relaxed hair to to going natural like, i've always been natural and i've always never did anything to my hair so the fact that i actually even dye it and bleach the ends kind of had me shook you know like i didn't know how my hair would react to it i didn't know if my hair my scalp was gonna be on fire like no i'm kidding but like i didn't know if you know my hair would take the dye the way it did and i didn't know if i would suffer like a lot of damage because everything's different for some people but i just it just made me more cautious to take better care of my hair like that i think i need to deep condition more often but and maybe moisturize it more often but i've been trying my best i don't know how some people do it like i don't know how people some people are just so obsessed with their hair that's like they're always they're always um deep conditioning it they have like a routine like i don't really feel like i have like a set day in the week that i do mine like i try to do mine by the end of the week but sometimes that carries over into the following week and then i don't even do it until like how many days later but like my i don't really have like a set schedule i just kind of like feel when my hair needs it and filling them in my eyebrows are already so thick my eyebrows in high school used to be so thick like they were just so nice and like i just went to so many different um eyebrow ladies that they just fucked up my eyebrows i mean they're not bad but like in high school i just slipped the one so i just feel like she really knew my face and knew how to get those eyebrows snatched so mm, i just burped <laughs> this is my favorite lip combo right now at the very moment like this these two products are always in my 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 purse so this is the dark brown jordana lip liner okay and then this is the mac lip glass this is the viva glam collection this is the ariana grande viva glam collection the lip gloss and it's just like a clear pink nudie color and yeah let me do this selfie style Alright guys, so I'm doing this selfie style now and I just decided to throw my hair up in this little poof, pineapple thing. And yeah, this is the finished look. Oh, I forgot to mention I'm in a new location. This is actually my my brother's room. So sorry if it looks a little bit different. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this get ready with me. I'm going to be back with another vi video soon. I plan to record again today. So, thank you so much for watching. Bye.